Welcome back, friends. It is so great to see our dear friends who you know and we love. And by the way, 99% of the time when I'm out and people say hi to me, I'm at Senor Julian's Mexican Bar and Grill. It happens all the time. So please welcome our dear friends, uh, Edson and Nelson and Senor Julian himself, the Viana family from Senor Julian. So good to see you guys. Thank, thank, you, thank you. Thank you for having us. And it, be honest, come on. We're there a lot. <laughs> it's, it's the an truth. Honor. It's an honor that you go visit us. Well, we love it. It, it's, it. To me, it reminds me, like when I first interviewed you, I am from Texas. This reminds me of my Tex-Mex roots, mm -hmm. my mom's cooking, mm -hmm. at home being in Texas with the amazing food. This is comfort food to me, Maddie. Mm -hmm. So when I found you, I gravitated, and I'm there almost every weekend. So if somebody hasn't been there yet, tell us about the restaurant itself and how you kind of decided to start it. Absolutely. So it's a, uh, a new concept in town. Uh, the way of season, like you said, we're in Northeast Mexico, so we're uh, big on the cooking, on grilling. Uh, we make our own homemade, homemade flour tortillas, which is a staple to the restaurant. It's a uh, new seasoning, all based on my dad's cooking after his years of experience. It started with having, you know, a family dream, uh, 70 years of family experience all together and doing what we love. Mm -hmm. so. How do you guys like all working together as a family? You know, they say it could go really great or sometimes really horribly, <laughs> but it looks like it's working out for you guys. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, so we're always close, you know, as a family. Uh, you know, we got ups and downs, like, like any family, but we always try to uh, work together. You know, we've yeah. been doing it for a long time, so it's kind of like second nature to us, you know. We yeah. sometimes, uh, you know, fight a little bit, but just That's family. It. That's family. That's me familia. Yeah. That's family. Yeah. Here we go. Can you tell us too about your mom and Brenda who are not here, part of the family? Absolutely. They're actually, you know, probably watching us right now. But, uh, uh, Brenda. <laughs> but um, yeah, um, Brenda, it's um, very important in the restaurant. She makes sure everything's running well. My mom, with her experience in front of the house, uh, leading us away, you know, like I said, everything bonds together. Um, together, they average alone over 30 years of experience. In the That's business. amazing. Wow. And I do have to say, I've started tagging along with Jeremy now. Whenever he goes on Saturdays, I'm like, yay, I'm finally Let's part of the go. Cool Kids Club. <laughs> but um, you guys are just, you create such a fun atmosphere. There's always sports on. There's always something for, I think, people of all ages to kind of watch and tune in. Now, we do have the big game coming up on Sunday. Absolutely. Will that be a place where people can congregate and watch it? So as of right now, uh, I believe we are going to close around 5 o'clock just so everyone, you know, the staff can go and watch it with their mm -hmm. uh, family and give them also like a half a day. So as much as we love to be open, you know, we just want to also keep in mind our staff, you know, so they can mm -hmm. enjoy the game as well. Well, That's can awesome. I come and get to go orders and sure then take can. it back to my big there game party? There you go. <laughs> because my favorite, by the way, their sister and his daughter is Brenda, and my favorite item on the menu is Brenda's enchiladas. Mm -hmm. I get it almost every single time, although I've been getting... Uh, Julian special Absolutely. recently. I love the Julian special named after Papa Julian. Uh, so now tell us about what you brought and the huge variety of Mexican food that you have and the different kind of twists that uh, maybe a lot of people around here don't know. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So we have the Mexican cough salad uh, starting off. Uh, it's a very fresh, uh, new uh, salad. It comes with black beans, uh, tortilla, um, strips on it and then we also have the norteña quesadilla which is it's a pretty big quesadilla as you can yeah. tell it's huge that's it massive comes with a lot of meats chicken steak uh, chorizo oh, um, oh my gosh. smoked sausage like i said we're from north mexico so we like to grill a lot we put it in a quesadilla and it's absolutely delicious oh yes. my gosh absolutely in the middle right here we have our authentic uh enchiladas tan pequeñas and just three enchiladas with uh, queso fresco and a uh, uh, steak and also a salad. That's how we eat our enchiladas from back home. Mm -hmm. uh, just right over here, we have the uh, pollo tampico, and that's kind of a mixture, some refreshing, you know, with our grilled chicken breast, um, a lot of a mixture of veggies that it's like zucchini, squash, red peppers with a creamy um, mushroom sauce. That's, you know, with my dad's recipe. It's served with rice and a salad. And lastly, we have a torta. This one, it's a, a pastor. It's actually one of my favorites as well. And it's a big hot Mexican sandwich served with seasoned fries. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's pretty good. You know, it has uh, uh, mayo, beans, uh, lettuce, a little so bit of everything. Mm -hmm. The pickled jalapeno is just over the top. 
It is so good. And to wash all this amazing food down. <laughs> we can't, I mean, the showstopper itself. What kind of margaritas did you bring today? Absolutely. Well, we have the famous and one of our staple, the Jumbo Margarita. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it's been an absolute favorite for the 417. Mm -hmm. uh, you can get it in Presidente style, spicy. Uh, right here we have our vodka margarita, uh, oh. which it's 100% made out of vodka, you know. Um, and then we go to our mezcal margarita. So there's, it's mezcal, it's like tequila, but it's made out of a different plants, you know, and it's smoked, has a smoky flavor behind it. Um, so it's a little bit different for those people who enjoy the mezcal. We put a little bit of tahini on the rim and an orange. Yes. Oh. And you could also, uh, I'm sorry, can you get to this one really fast? Because I've never ordered that, but I see people getting them. Absolutely. So it's also a very common one when, uh, you know, a uh, party of six plus. I've seen people do two, so it's, it's okay. <laughs> so this is our biggest uh, size on, when it comes down to margarita. Uh, it's the uh, Margarita Tower. It's 88 ounces of uh, Love, I'll call it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It depends. It could be, you know, I said I've seen people from uh, two to six share it, but yeah, it's eight eight ounces. Um, and in the middle, last uh, we have the uh, spicy margarita. That's also a great hit. Uh, it's a house margarita blend with uh, jalapenos, a little bit tajin, chamoy. Mm. It gives you that kick, you know, that uh, a little spicy with the uh, margarita. And lastly, it's one of our latest creations right here. It's our gin margarita. Ooh, gin. Yeah, so Interesting. you got to be a little careful with this one because yeah. when we were trying it, you know, we were just trying to come up with a recipe. <laughs> yeah. Before we know it, yeah, it was, it was feeling, feeling no it, pain. Feeling no pain. <laughs> it's our latest so. creation, so we're very proud of it. Um, people That's really amazing. enjoy it. Yeah, okay, awesome. and then we have exciting, exciting news. Yes. They've been in business just a little over a year and it was just announced last week, you guys have already won two awards for the best of 417 Magazine. Who wants to talk about that? That's amazing. Yeah, absolutely. So um, after, um, we want to say thank you first of all and foremost for the 417, the love they've shown. Uh, we actually won um, best Mexican food and best new restaurant in the 417. So it is a complete honor. Um, it is not just a one person uh, award, mm -hmm. it's a whole family together. And overall to our team. Mm -hmm. uh, I tell my team all the time, you know, I believe I have the best team in the 417. Mm -hmm. They all of all of our employees are hard worker, dedicated to to the family restaurant. Yeah, so uh -huh. we're just thankful. You know, my dad as well. He's thankful mm -hmm. from just the day we opened. We always felt the love, the support from the 417. You know, so also want to give a big thanks to 417 uh, Land and our team as well. Yes, yeah, thank you guys so much. So you awesome. guys will see us here, Maddie. Let's dig into this while we're waiting. <laughs> oh yes. Uh, and, <laughs> Go check out Senior Hulings. You're going to see me and Maddie there almost every weekend. Yes, you will. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much. Congratulations as well. Yes.